Hey guys, it's Justin here from Jack Production Studios, and today I am going to be doing another LEGO tutorial video. So, yeah, today we're going to be building this right here. This is my droid recharging station. I did get inspiration for, uh, to make one of these from Andrew, LEGO Black on Build. So, yeah, without further ado, let's get right into the tutorial. Alright, to start off with building this, you're going to need all the pieces that are on the screen right now. So, you're going to need... Uh, two plates. One is a 4x10, I believe. Yeah, 4x10. And then another one is a 4x6. You're going to need a... You're going to need two of these. These will make the base of it. Alright. And you're going to need five of these 2x2 light bluish gray tiles. Uh, 14 of these 1x2x5s. Uh, dark bluish gray. Six of the 1x2 slopes. Uh, dark bluish gray. Uh, you're going to need 20 of these, it's, I'm pretty sure it's 20, of uh, these uh, 1 by 2 light bluish gray bricks with the, well, indents, I'm not really sure what this is called. But yeah, then you're going to need these 1 by 2 inverted slopes, dark bluish gray. You're going to need 6 of these. You're going to need 2 of these uh, 1 by, or 2 by 6 uh, bricks, uh, dark bluish gray. And then you're going to need 4 of these uh, 2 by 4s, I believe. No, five of the 2 by 4 sorry. There's another one right here. Alright, so uh, without further ado, let's get right into it. And also, just another note, you're going to need five droids many times. So, yeah, let's start by building this. So, start off, you're going to take these, and you're going to start connecting them. You're going to put 2x4s on, in the back. So, now we're starting to get the structure done. That should use the four two by fours and both plates. Next, you're gonna go through and you're gonna put tiles, down. and you're gonna skip each end, and you're also gonna skip, I believe, one brick. Yep, you're gonna well, one stud in between, so it should look like this. Next, you're gonna take your slopes, the uh, one by two slopes, and you're gonna put those on. Once you have those on, uh, now you get to uh, start putting on the 1x2x5s. So you get start off by putting one here. And you get to line up the entire back row with those. So I'm going to do that now. Oh, I, forgot, I also forgot to include, but you're going to need uh, five of these bricks right here. The like blue, well, trans light blue uh, studs, one by one studs, and so should end up placing all of the uh, one by two by fives. I just realized that we're already three and a half minutes into this. All right. Okay, let's send this back up. Now you have this built. And now you're going to need these spots where the droids charge. So you're going to take the 1 by... I forgot to include, you also need these. Uh, 1 by 2 uh, bricks with the hole in the middle for a Technic pin. And then you're going to take these. And you're going to stack this up. Put this together like this. And then you're going to put a stud right in that hole. I'm going to do that for the rest of them. Alright, and once you have this built, times five, uh, what you're going to do is just uh, take these, you're going to take one of these and slide them into each of these panels, and I apologize if you hear any background noise, because there's vacuuming going on. So I'm going to try to finish this up. So now you're going to take the 2x6 uh, bricks, put them on either side at the top, and then you're going to take the 2x4, and you're going to put it in the middle. And you're going to take these inverted slopes, and you will put them on each of the available studs, and I'm going to pause the video until the vacuuming is done. Alright, well, it's not done, but it's not right outside of my door. So now, once it's done, you should have the finished project. It should look like this. Now, I'm just going to take the for this demonstration. 
Now, if you just take them, you connect uh, the stud on the back of the droid to the stud right there. It should allow for the droids the droid should really fit in, nice and snug. It's kind of a tight fit, and in fact, oh, I just dehydrated a commando droid. You're going to need that arm out in front. So now if I put the board back in, they can do the same with the other commando droids. And it allows for e easy charging of the uh, commando droids. And they're able to sit here and charge in peace. I don't know. But yeah, so I hope you guys enjoy. This is what the finished product looks like. You can always, like, this was intended for it to be built into a wall. You guys can always do whatever you want with this, you know. But, uh, yeah. There. So, I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, please make sure to rate, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.